Welcome back, Overlook Garage. That's about 545, and we are headed to West Columbia to look at a 65 C10 fleet size short bed truck. Um, got good patina. Talked to the guy yesterday, got posted. Um, locked it in, a uh, pretty good deal. Uh, we're gonna head over there real early this morning, this Sunday morning. Um, like I said, it's 545, tired. Woke up pretty early yesterday morning to go to a car show. And uh, had a long last night at the fair with the kids, so yeah. Um, we're gonna get on the road pretty early, hopefully get there by 8.45, 9 o'clock, and check this thing out. So just wanna bring you guys along. I know it's been a little while since I've done one of these. Um, so stay tuned. <laughs> to Columbia. I don't know what I was thinking. I think I had my maps. I had my point of start in Athens. I was looking at another truck. When I typed in this address, it said about two and a half hours, which I should have known better because Columbia ain't that far. So uh, we ran probably the speed limit the whole way. So we're trying to kill some time. So we just pulled over at Waffle House. Uh, we can't be there till about 830. So we're going to kill about an hour and Hopefully soon we'll be looking at a truck. We got old Albert loaded up, come to find out. That's what she called him. They did us a nice solid and had it pulled out and most of the tires pumped up. We had to change one out and um, got it loaded up, pulled out of there, wasn't too bad. Back on the road, it is 8.40 in the morning. So we should be back in Lincoln in about an hour and a half. And I'll give y'all a little walk around of it. She's patinaed up pretty good. Hopefully it'll turn out to be a pretty good truck. It's 327 with automatic. I don't even know what tranny's in it, but we'll find out. I would probably guess turbo 350, but all right. Stay tuned. All right, we got her home in the rain. It's finally cleared out and turned out to be a nice day. So I figured I'd get out here and do a little walk around with the truck real quick. This is her. She's crusty and rusty. We do not believe that is a 327. Dad thinks it's either a 305 or 350, but I hadn't laid back there and got the block numbers off yet. She's, uh, she's got it. She is sun blistered. Um, it's factory light blue with a white top, two-tone standard option, so had no moldings or anything, so.
Got some factory wheels and dog dishes I'm gonna put on it. At least get it where we can roll it around a little better, have a matching set of wheels. And probably, well, we gotta get this black truck done first. So it's probably gonna go sit down there with a 64 for a while. We gotta get this black 65 done, then we can mess with this a little bit, see if we can get this on the road. But black 66 is priority right now, so. This is it. It's got some sort of seat in it. I have no idea where the seat come out of, but I don't know. It don't even fit, but it's got some nice carpet in there out of someone's house, but not too bad. Get her cleaned up. See what she turns out like. 